Let's go. So the very first card that we're going to go ahead and start with is going to be the blue cast preferred card from American Express. <laughs> And then on the, on the middle is gonna be the Discover It Cash Back, and at the end, you're gonna see the Capital One Venture Rewards credit card, okay? So let's go ahead and start off with the credit scores that you need. At minimum, you're gonna need about a 670 credit score to apply for any of these credit cards. Now, I have seen people get approved for the Discover It if it was like a 640, 650, but again, 670 minimum is most definitely gonna have you at a better approval uh, rate, uh, you know, of course, and it's not just Discover It. Now, American Express, you could probably get away with about a 650 as well too but again stay around about 670 and you'll most definitely be fine all right let's go into the rewards rates okay so i'm gonna zoom in just a tad bit so you guys can see this a little bit better all right give me a second here there we go there we go okay perfect all right so now um the rewards rate so with american express you'll be able to get six percent cash back at u.s supermarkets up no, up to six thousand dollars per year and then it's going to drop down to one percent that's huge because a lot of times people see um how things go and then they'll say oh you know what um well i get six percent yeah but that's only for a short period of time and then after one year then it's going to drop down to uh one percent okay i'm sorry not to one, have one year but once you reach six thousand then it's going to drop down to one percent okay then you get 6% cash back on select U.S. streaming subscriptions, 3% cash back on transit, including taxis, ride share, parking, tolls, trains, buses, and more, okay? 3% cash back on gas stations, and 1% cash back on other purchases. So you, uh, in short, you get a lot of cash back, all right? Next is going to be Discover. Now, this one's going to give you 5% cash back uh, on everyday purchases uh, on different places, like on each quarter, too. Amazon.com, grocery stores, restaurants, gas stations, and up to the quarterly maximum uh, once you activate. And then you'll be able to get 1% uh, unlimited cash back on all other purchases and that's going to be automatically okay now with capital one you're going to get five miles okay so five miles per dollar on hotels rental cars booked through capital one travel if you don't travel a lot because traveling is a little bit different traveling is more so like hey i'm going to this place okay and so you'll be able to get that for sure and you're going to be able to get 1.2 miles per dollar on every purchase and uh and it's going to be every day so their biggest thing is travel miles and things of that sort so if you're looking for more of a rewards a percentage of cash back or something like that that may not be necessarily the best car for you okay annual fees they're all zero dollars except for uh american express the, now that's gonna be for the first year zero dollars and then next year is 95 dollars. you know how many people miss that they'll say oh i see they had a zero dollar annual fee and then and then a year later it goes up you guys got to pay attention to these terms and agreements because uh there are sometimes you'll see something but you don't know that how long that's going to be some things aren't forever okay then you have your regular apr now remember all those perks that they were giving you well, this is how you paying for it. At minimum, you're going to be able to get 18.99% with American Express. And then that's going to be, yeah, I'm going to leave it like this so you guys can kind of see that a little bit better, okay? And I'm going to zoom back up. Okay, there we go. All right, so now that's 18.99%, 29.99% on the high end with Amex, okay? Discover It is going to be 16.99% on the low end, which is pretty good. And remember, you're already getting that 5% on all of those other places that they were just talking about as well, too, okay? But 16.99% on the low end and then 27.99% on the high end. With the Venture Card, you're going to be at 19.99% and then, of course, 29.99% on the high end, okay? So then let's talk about Intro APR. Everyone's going to be giving you 0%, but for how long is the question, okay? American Express will give you 0% for 12 months. Discover is going to give you 0% for 15 months. And then Capital One is going to give you 0% for 15 months as well. So you get a shorter time with American Express, again, because they're giving you all that cash back rewards at the beginning like we talked about, okay? Then balance transfers. Now, what's, what's too great about these cards? People be forgetting. These credit cards do way more than just have rewards, points, miles, all that type of stuff, cash back, all that's great. But don't forget, you can still do a balance transfer with them too. 0% for 12 months, that's a pretty standard situation. Discover it's gonna give you 0% for 15 months and then Capital One's gonna give you 0% for 15 months as well. So that's amazing, okay? Now let's go into some of the highlights, okay? And then I'll bring this down again so you guys can you know, have it like where it, you guys can actually see it. Give me a second here. Here we go. Okay, cool. All right, so now the highlight is going to be a $250 uh, statement credit after you spend $3,000 in and in, uh, in purchases on your new car within six months. That means you got to do two things, $3,000 in six months. If you do uh, $3,000 in seven months, you won't qualify, okay? If you do three, th if you end up doing $2,000 in, uh, in six months, you're not going to qualify because you didn't meet that limit, okay? And then, of course, zero intro annual fee, then $95. And then, of course, buy now, pay later. Enjoy zero per, uh, $0 intro plan fees when you use plan to split up large purchases in monthly installments this is new okay um pay zero uh, dollars in intro plan fees 
um, on, on plan fees, on plans creating on plans created during the first 12 months of the day to day account opening. Plans created after that will have a monthly fee of about 1.33% uh, of eligible purchase amount moved into the plan or the duration of the APR otherwise apply uh, to the purchase and other factors. Okay. You don't have to go that route. You can just swipe and then just pay on it like you guys normally do. Okay. Now discover it highlights. This is going to again, like we talked about, it's going to get you an introductory, an introductory offer, unlimited cashback match only from discover and they'll automatically match the cash that you've earned at the end of the year. There's no minimum spending or maximum rewards and you can turn $150 cash back into $300. Guys, that's huge. Okay. Earn 5% cash back on everyday purchases. We talked about that and discover can help reduce the, the, uh, the exposure of personal information. Eh, everybody kind of do that. But anyway, uh, <laughs> Capital One Venture, $0 annual fee, earn a bonus of 20,000 miles once you spend $500 in within three months. Guys, that is huge. How many of you all can spend uh, $500 in three months? I know y'all can, okay? And that's what it is. A lot of people are using their credit cards like they're using their debit cards. If you can manage that properly, then you should be good to go, especially when you can get something like this. Then you're going to earn unlimited 1.25x 1.2, uh, 1 uh, on the miles uh, every time you do a purchase, and that's every single day. Miles do not expire for the life of the account, and there's no limit to how many miles you guys can earn. Okay, you earn five times the miles on hotels, rental cars, both through Capital One Travel. So you got to go through Capital One Travel uh, to maximize that, guys. And it looks like your miles will get reimbursed uh, for any travel purchase or redeemed by booking through Capital One. Uh, dot com. Okay, you can transfer your miles and go from there. Okay, and then it goes into other things that we kind of talked about um, as well too. And they go into you can also get one hundred and twenty dollars in statement credits. Um, now this is going to be again with uh, American Express. American Express is always about kind of being. They want to treat you like a member, okay? Because technically, it you are a member, but they've always made people feel more a little bit more exclusive. So they're going to have a little bit more of the perk side because again, they to go a little bit deeper, okay? But they also have it where you can get a Disney bundle and you can save money. You can uh, uh, you can save money on that as well too, but you got to use your American Express, uh, you know, blue cash card, and to take advantage of that guy. Okay, and so those are the cards being compared. We'll catch you guys on the next video.